This is question 6 from paper 1 of the 2015 SQA Curriculum for Excellence Higher Maths exam. It's a log question. The laws of logs that we're going to be using are the following. If you add the logs of two numbers, you'll get the same result as the log of their product. So adding two logs of numbers, multiply the numbers, you'll get the same log. Another result we're going to use the log of a number raised to a power that power can move down to the front and multiply the log of the number. So log to the base A of a power of a number, bring the index down to the front, multiply and remove that power. The last thing is being able to read something for instance like this and work out exactly what it is. I usually read this as what power do you raise 10 to to get 100? And the answer is 2. What power do you raise 2 to to get 8? Answer is 3. What power do you raise 2 to to get square root of 2? The answer is a half. 2 to the power of half is the square root of 2. What power do you raise 3 to to get 81? The answer is 4. So all of these can be worked out by reading them in, an, in a special way. So I think we've got enough now to tackle this question. So we're looking at the log to the base 6 of 12. And we have to add a third of log to the base 6 of 27. Now I'm looking at this number 27. Let's just leave this first term as it is. I'm looking at this number 27 and thinking that's 3 to the power 3. And since I'm aware of this rule here that I've got the log of a number to a power, you can bring the power down, multiply it at the front. I'm thinking this 3 coming down to the front 3 times a third, that's going to help me. So let's do that. We'll bring this power to the front and multiply. And remove the power. So this helps in the sense that the third of three times a third is just one. So it certainly simplifies what we've got. And now look what we have. We have the addition of two logs. We've got the log of a number 12, log of a number 3. We're adding these two logs so we can end up rewriting that as the log of the product of these two numbers, 12 times 3. So that's log to the base 6 of 36. And now our discussion about how to read numerical examples of logs. Log to the base 6 of 36. We can read this as what power do we raise 6 to to get 36? Well, 6 squared is 36, so the answer is 2. We raise 6 to the power 2 to get 36. And there's our evaluation of this expression.